It's Christmas season. It's a chaotic time, let alone on top of all this, it is a global pandemic. Do you ever feel like, I just wish I had a moment of peace? Well, this is the second week of Advent and we're reflecting on the theme of the week, peace. So there are two different kinds of peace, right? One is negative peace, the other is positive peace. Negative peace is a no problem peace. Think of it like life before COVID-19. Right? There were no issues. Life was just smooth sailing. And then there's positive peace. It's the peace within the chaos. And most of us in this world want negative peace, right? We don't want any issues. We want a happy family, a happy life, want to be able to afford our basic necessities, maybe one day retire and just chill, right? No issues. But here's what Jesus says in Luke chapter 14, verse 27, he says, I give you my peace. The peace that I give is not the one that the world offers. So it's not the common perception of peace, which is negative peace. Then he goes on to say, well, don't be afraid. I've got you. So he's talking about positive peace. The kind of peace he gives is within the problems of this life, within the chaos of this life. And his peace comes because of his promises. And he promises to be with us to guide us through the troubles of this life, to lift us up when we feel like we're sinking. He promises to be with us within the craziness and the chaos, the tornadoes of our life. He holds us up. We have his peace, the peace that surpasses all understanding. And even when there is chaos, we know God's got us. Even when there are problems, he's upholding us. The peace of Christ is unlike the world. It's peace that surpasses all understanding. Well, that's uh, our second week of Advent.